Good morning, everyone. What a lovely morning. It's actually really, really warm as well. T-shirt on, nothing else. Well, I'll say nothing else. I've obviously got my trousers on as well. But yeah, clear blue skies, looking absolutely stunning. We had a good night's sleep here in Minehead and we're gonna have a quick bit of breakfast. It's quite late, I did come out earlier, um, but now time is getting on, so quick bit of breakfast and then we're going to hit the road to go and explore the local area. So we'll get that done and get on the road, see what we can see. We'll catch you then, bye. until I know what I'm dealing with and then I might drive back but I get a little bit scared because I'm not very spatially aware um, so on the tiny roads I kind of go breathing which is a bit embarrassing for everyone so anyway we'll catch up with you later caravan bye you
you can see Ricky with his coat over his head trying to fly his drone. There was some beeping going on there, which didn't sound too good. And I can't hear the drone. It's back. It's back. It's up there. It's not lost it. There it is. There it is. There's the drone. I thought he'd lost it. But he hasn't. Lost you. Bye. <laughs> Such fun. Right, it's my turn to drive. It could go horribly wrong, so wish me luck, everyone, and Ricky. Didn't care for one another, you and I, you and I Thought I was okay, till something in me changed Don't know why, don't know why You got me high, but I'm sober You make me lonely when I'm by myself There she is on the bridge, look, waiting for me. I think she's getting a bit impatient, so we better head on after her. Oh, she's not hanging around either, to be honest. Oh, couldn't care less, she's gone. Come on, dear, let's go. I want to go up and just back to the vernacular railway. That's oh, easy for you to say. Right. Yeah, <laughs> I'm just showing everybody this lovely little stream under the bridges. All right, bloody hell, all right. What did you describe this as? Vernacular. Sorry? Vernacular, vernacular, vernacular. Yeah. Sorry? Vernacular, it's, right. it's the mask. That's what she's talking about. So we're about to go up there. <laughs> we're driving. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> 
The multi-award winning Cliff Railway opened in 1890. It is the highest and steepest totally water-powered railway in the world. The Cliff Railway connects the twin towns of Lynmouth at the bottom and Linton at the top. It's the UK's only fully water-powered railway and one of just three that are left in the world. The original flat platforms were used for freight. Freight came in from boats into the harbour at Lynmouth and was taken up to Linton at the top. The flat platforms were converted into passenger carriages in 1947. Technically, it's actually a lift, not a railway. In 1887, an Act of Parliament authorised the operators to be called the Linton and Lynmouth Lift Company. Five hundred feet above the lower station is the Cliff Top Cafe at Linton. Come on then. Cute little carriage. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, here we are up at the top that's incredible we'll find out some more details about it and how it works and where it was built and that's where we drove down from earlier you can see right off in the distance here and I drove down the hill and Ricky shot the drone footage I think he scared us all silly we nearly lost the drone but anyway we're learning Right, being the complete power muppets that we are, we've decided it would be a good idea to walk back down. So we're heading down this very steep hill. I'll show you it. Down here, all the way back down to the bottom. Which was and ironically my idea, and I've got bad knees. Yeah, so. but hopefully, is there a car behind? I can hear something. Yeah. Hopefully, when we get to the bottom, we'll get a coffee if we don't get run over by this vehicle first. Bye. Down it it. Could have done both. What walked up it and down it? Well, you probably could have run it. Yeah, probably. Yeah. In in minutes, if that. Am I walking? Do I look like I've soiled myself? Thought you had. Oh. Gosh. Bloody hell. <laughs> what have I done? Can we get on the railway halfway? Whose idea was this? <laughs> We're still going down. This would have been much easier if we'd gone back on the railway. Much easier. I'm sure it's getting steeper as well. You might have to slow down. I can't go any slower. <laughs> I'm sorry, I've got to show you this. Unbelievable. I'm keeping back. You just tell me if there's someone behind No, me. I'm not telling you. You do it yourself. If you want to walk like that. Oh, 
don't hurt my knees. That's just ridiculous. It hurt my knees no, this way. it's ridiculous. Just tell me left or right. No, do it yourself. <laughs> if you're going to walk like that, you need to get some wing mirrors. <laughs> Can I have a reversing sensor? Hmm. Beep, beep, wide right. road. Well, not going to argue with that. Yeah. We are getting quite low now, though. Look, compared to where we were. Do you reckon? Yeah. Yeah, film this and we'll reverse it and up to like I'm really like storming up the hill. I'm storming something. <sighs> We've made it back down again. Yep, these are okay. And I think we can agree we did it in style. <laughs> I think so. Definitely. If we can agree anything, we can agree that. That is style. Also, <laughs> look what we found now. Beth's going to go and do her fact finding mission to find out what's going on and why we have this water feature. Water exhibition, like the power of water exhibition. Uh, okay, it's a water exhibition. Let's go and find out what's going on. Okay, so. This is actually to generate hydroelectric power, which is very clever. And I we used to live not that far away from here for quite a long time, and I had no idea about this. So, Britain's first experimental tidal current turbine was in Lynmouth Bay and is now relocated to the Glen Lynn Gorge. Who knew? So this is called Maybridge. It's all part of the rebuild after the floods. Apparently, this road along here didn't exist before the floods. It was actually the riverbed. And this is what's left of the riverbed. I can't keep looking that way that on these windy roads. So you just go. So. Don't worry about holding that camera in front of the mirror. <laughs> um, oh. Another thing that's quite cool about here is look how steep. <laughs> the flat platforms were converted into passenger carriages in 1847. No, they weren't because that was before it was built. <laughs> 